Hi guys, this is Jess here. I hope uh, you actually had a wonderful day today. Um, the reason why I'm here today is to show you how to use blur effect uh, in Camtasia Studio 7. Uh, you know, sometimes uh, we record um, uh, some videos and uh, we just I want to hide uh, part of our um, uh, screen. So, uh, like uh, for example, in this screen, I just want to hide my email address at the top. I, I don't want it if I'm doing a video on Facebook. Um, so, what it, it's really easy to actually just you know hide it uh, by using the blur effect that actually comes uh, out of box in Camtasia Studio 7. So um, to do that, uh, we actually have to go to uh, the to apply that effect. We have to go to uh, the uh, callouts, and um, there are a number of callouts that you can actually use here. Uh, you can actually pick uh, any uh, one of them for a specific purpose. But for the time being, we are actually interested in only the blur one that we actually have under special uh, call, uh, callout. So we'll actually just uh, hit click here. We'll actually create, as you can see, it will create uh, a rectangular box that you can actually, you know, um, you can actually uh, adjust height and uh, width of that box. And once you're satisfied uh, with the height and width, you can actually take it, drag it, and place it on top of uh, um, the area that you want to hide. And uh, that's pretty much it. Um, the other good thing is that uh, um, um, uh, if if this area actually is repeated um, throughout your video, then uh, what you can actually do is uh, just go uh, click on your blur effect and highlight it. And uh, you see that uh, when you hover, that actually produce a little uh, red um, uh, like a pipe. So what you do, do is you just hold that pipe and then drag it till uh, that page actually remain inside of the user. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Uh, once this is done, uh, you can see that uh, the above uh, thing doesn't actually change at all. Uh, another thing is, uh, I'm not, uh, another thing tip I want to give you is that uh, when doing that stuff, it's your own preference, but I don't like, uh, you know, the fade in and fade out effect, but you can actually try it, uh, give it a try and then see how that actually fits um, uh, with your requirements. Um, but yeah, I mean, uh, this is the quick tip uh, video tutorial for you guys, like how to use a blur effect. I hope uh, you actually enjoy it. Um, and know uh, how you can actually do a blur effect in Camtasia Studio. Really easy, quick. Don't forget to visit justpreetchahal.org uh, for more fun videos and uh, tutorials. Uh, I've been working hard lately on uh, producing more quality stuff for you guys. Um, for, the time, for the timing, I have to say goodbye to you. I'll actually catch up with some more interesting stuff next time. Cheers. Bye.